Hi, this is Kathy Sparrow. I'm the literary midwife, and I have a question for you. What's stopping you? What's stopping you from writing your book? I know so many people who have said, I have this book idea, I've been wanting to do it, think about it all the time, I have some notes, I even started writing a little bit, but you stop. Sound like you? And I've done it. Been there, done that. I was once told by my high school guidance counselor that I'd never be a writer. And that was a big obstacle from for me stepping out into the world and writing. It probably took me 10 years before I was brave enough to write my first uh, personal essay. And that was way back 30 years ago. And I wrote it about climbing uh, a very small mountain, which at the time for me was a huge mountain because I was afraid of heights. And uh, I wrote a piece, how I overcame that fear that day because I saw this beautiful hawk flying down below me. And I typed it out because no computers yet, put it in the mail, no internet yet. And I sent it to a local community arts paper. And a couple of days later, I got a phone call from Leah Locke, who was the publisher and editor. And she said, I can't use that piece because I don't publish personal essays, but I love your writing. And I'd like you to do some stories for me. I, that gig lasted six years. And had I hesitated, had I still fell in line with that mandate by that, <laughs> that uh, guidance counselor, I wouldn't be writing. I still wouldn't be writing. But I took a chance. I listened to that calling inside of me that said, I have something to say. I have a gift to share with the world. And so I overcame that fear, I felt the fear and just did it anyway. And I wrote that piece and sent it out. And the possibilities that that unfolded afterward were just, uh, have just been incredible. I truly live a writable life. And I still have times in my career where that fear comes up and I start going, oh, I don't know whether I can do this. I just recently stepped into screenwriting and, and there was this little fear like, oh, maybe we should just have our agent write the scripts for us for the and for Stanky and CC Adventures, the animation scripts. And then I realized it was that old voice from that guidance counselor who uh, was still there, right? Still hanging out in my, my consciousness. And I went, oh, that's not going to stop me. So again, if you can name the dragon, you can slay the dragon. And if you know what's stopping you from writing, you can find solutions to begin writing.